Okay, so I finished milling out all the little flat areas that I need to here on the intake runners. This is a uh, uh, number uh, three, number four, and uh, here's number one, number two, and then back in the, there on the end is number five, number six. So all of these uh, intake runners been flattened out on the bottom. I will come in and round off these edges with uh, just a little sanding drum uh, on the end of my rotary tool. Uh, there's little sanding discs in the uh, cylinder head porting kit that I bought. Um, so I'll round those off. But what I need to come in and do right now is tap out uh, these open holes here uh, that the bosses, there's no boss under it there. So we gotta tap those holes out and put a pipe plug in there. Here's my, uh, my new little pipe tap uh, and the pipe plug. And I keep mentioning pipe uh, and that's what they are, but there's several different kinds uh, of, of pipe threads. Uh, in this case, I'm actually using NPT. So this is a 3 8 inch NPT pipe plug. As you can see there, uh, 3764 drill for the hole. Unfortunately, I don't have a 3764 drill bit, nor do I have a 9 16 inch drill bit, which is uh, 1 64th of an inch smaller than the 37 64th. This hole, I measured it out to uh, 17 64ths. So we're a couple sizes too small, but I'm gonna go ahead and give it a shot and try and tap this out. Usually with pipe taps, you, they're a little bit different than regular taps. Regular taps, you usually, you know, turn them in half a turn, three quarters of a turn, back them off about a quarter, and then keep going. And when you back them off a quarter, you kind of clear the chips uh, out of the, uh, the cutting teeth. With a pipe tap, usually you just want to start it and go. Um, but in this case, I'm actually probably going to have to uh, cut a little bit, back it up, cut a little bit more, back it up, and so on and so forth. So what I'm going to try and do is uh, get this uh, pipe plug so that the bottom of the pipe plug is flush with the ceiling there. So I'm gonna tap it out a little bit, test my pipe plug. Uh, if I need to do some more, then I'll tap it out some more. And I'll just keep working at it until uh, the bottom of this pipe plug is flush with the ceiling of this intake runner. Another thing I, saw, I should also mention, I don't have a tap handle for a half inch uh, square drive tap. I do have a tap set, but it is for a 3 8 inch, so I don't have the, the appropriate tap handle for this, but I do have a 5 8 inch 12-point uh, socket, which this fits into um, perfectly. So that's what I'm going to be using to uh, tap my hole. 